I had a really hard time getting started and having that pressure of being an expert or feeling like I should know everything since I graduated undergrad. I have a degree now, I should know. Um, and then very quickly learning that you almost know nothing, right? Um, but so coming to terms with that and being like, that's why I'm here though, it, it, it is to learn, it is to realize what I don't know. And the fact that that's always gonna be the case and that's exciting, it's a good thing, not a bad thing. And so now when I'm teaching, now when I'm like doing my own research or presenting even, I, I think I've found a much better balance and that's grown a lot into how I teach other people and to how um, I'm like forgiving with myself as I go along. And so that's been the biggest change. And I think I try to take time to reflect each year on like what do I need to do versus what has gotten better. My ability to hold my own and feel like I can contribute has definitely grown. <laughs> grad school is so unpredictable versus the goods, the bads, the opportunities, the short, like the shortcomings. Um, and that was really hard for a while because you're dealing with these very human emotional um, mountains to get over and also trying to be a successful kind of scientist and not have emotions to get through those things. And so I think that being understanding to that, that things are going to go be very flexible and very fluid um, is something you really have to be open to. You're going to experience kind of getting knocked down a lot, but that is like an important part of it, knowing that things might fail and probably for a silly reason, um, especially in the coding aspect. I, I think when you get into um, the experimental realm, there has to just be much more focus placed on prepping and making sure things are exact before you start. You can be emotional for like two seconds and then it's just back to the books of like you have a list to get done and just figure out the way to rewrite this subtask list for yourself. And so I'd say the emotions are still there, but it's less, um, it's more contained. It's like, okay, here's this, doesn't speak to me and my quality as a student. And that's where, um, the, that's been a big switch. That intimidation and that kind of feeling dumb, honestly, for a good amount of time goes away um, they're all because, you know, again, I, I think reiterating from something I mentioned before is you're going to feel kind of dumb and there's always going to be things you don't know, but you learn how to take that in stride and you learn how to kind of use it to your advantage of making connections, making collaborations.